Hello everybody, this is Darth Ravage 07 coming at you today with another quick video review. This time I give you the history behind my video reviews. It was in this store right here, and actually the Steinmark. This was the Roses in a place called Grace in North Asheville. That's the backside of Reynolds Mountain right there. This is the rest of what is known as Grace, but this is where all the collecting had began was in that Rosa store in the very, very, very back corner there. My great uncle took me in there with about 20 bucks. Got me started on my GI Joes and my Transformers and he helped me get that Night Raven that was so sweet back in the day. And today I'm bringing fast forward to the year 2020. I finally got my hands on a really, really cool item in the GI Joe series. One moment, please. Here is the Cobra Hiss tank it's a retro three-quarter inch vehicle uh figure transportation vehicle all nine yards very very cool that i finally got this guy at the uh local walmart i never had this i'm gonna get out of his box and uh let you guys know how he sums up thanks again for watching if you haven't done so below right down there is the links to my cruises inc website and other uh good stuff so uh check that out when you get a chance please subscribe and don't forget to set your notifications to all reminders thanks again for watching again this is so cool this is the first vehicle i've opened up in a long time when it comes to gi joe kind of packaging there's the hiss driver and the components let me get this thing together and real quick right here is the hiss tank with the hiss driver and the no decals i finally got it together there and i uh, was just checking things out and what have you and uh i gotta say man it's kind of kind of gold right there i can't believe i finally got it this guy's got very simple articulation i guess he just sits in here and pilots that and uh he looks really great all around it's got cobra trooper so i wonder if that's a typo and it's supposed to be hiss driver or whatnot anyway I got a Cobra Trooper dog tag, just to dust aside. And here's the Hiss tank minus the decals, just kind of give you that last look of how plain it is when you first get it out. And then, of course, uh, I'll get those uh, decals on there and then we'll keep continuing on with the, the quick review. Thanks again for all those who are watching. Can't believe this is in my hands. And here is the Hiss tank all dolled up with his goody stuff. He's got stuff there, 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 and details there. Up front here you got the Cobra emblem there. You got a little detail there and some other detail on the bottom. Same side, you got the details on the sides. From this rear view you got a dash con sticker and that. And now for the final ingredient one second please and this here i think is where it really shines is when you can actually put your 3.75 inch your three and three quarter inch figures back in there to your vehicles and the playability goes to the roof i really do love having this in hand and uh <laughs> i just whipped it together here in the last few minutes and i'm so tickled with it i never did have this tank in no form at all when i was a kid and uh having it here right now just takes me like keto said back to 1984 when you go down those aisles and you got <laughs> all the cool stuff with transformers you got marvel you got all this other stuff out there then you're seeing he-man i think if i seen thundercats out there i'd be just like keto and i'd lose it and uh <laughs> just another thing to throw money at uh back into this is uh got a little hitch that you can hitch on stuff and the figures can also be ported right here so you can have two more f figures riding right there i just got these two right here and i got snake eyes at home don't think it's appropriate for snake eyes to ride a cobra based enemy vehicle unless he's thrashing it and stuff but this is definitely going to go proudly on my man case shelf with the, the joes and uh so if i had to have a three and three quarter vehicles amongst the six inch then so be it i was really hoping to see that we get some six inch vehicles uh but it, it'd probably be ungodly in cost and just not you know these were expensive enough when I, we were growing up 
and I got this like from or when we got stuff from Roses back then in the day and my budget was 20 bucks 20 bucks used to buy quite quite a bit if you spent it right uh, and buy you uh, a set of cassette tapes and two other you know basic figures like Braun and Bumblebee or you get one warrior figure which would be like side swipe hoist and mirage in them or you could God, I think Uncle put together a little bit more to get me the Night Raven because I just I was in love with the SR seventy one bite bird, and that is what it represents pretty much. And uh, that was just a really cool one. The the landing gear actually rolled, retracted, and I think it even shot uh, the stuff outside of the shuttle drone being able to do that. But enough about that. His his tank does not disappoint for the kid at heart. So with all that said and done, this is going to get a huge yo-jo and uh, highly recommend if you can find this or the All Striker. Uh, the guy get the I gotta get a hold of the All Striker still, but uh, I really high, highly recommend folks to to if you're a fan don't don't pass up on the opportunity, don't postpone happiness, and uh, enjoy your uh, collections. Uh, thanks again for watching. It's like I said, it's going back into the house there and be with the rest of my Joe stuff. And uh, thank you, Hasbro, for releasing it all these years later in such fine detail and high quality. And uh, that's going to about do it, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, check out those vacation packages in the description below. I'll try to leave a link to find this guy if I can find a, an Amazon link for it. And hopefully, it won't be unruly. Like, I gotta go take that other one down for the Iron Hide SS. That was unruly. I didn't even see it. I just got to looking at it after the fact when I was testing and link. All right, so thanks again for watching Darth Ravage 07's quick reviews, and uh, hope that'll help you guys that are Joe fans get on out there and get her done, get this get this thing into your uh, collection. Yo, Joe, have a good night.